everyone. I'm here to tell you about yeah, Sarab Naresh Natravelkar. He knows you. He's an right? Oracle engineer, and many people don't know this, but he's also a cricket player for Team USA. And many people say he's the reason Team USA won against Pakistan in the World Cup games that happened back in June. We first heard about this when cricket fans started tagging the Oracle corporate social media accounts. So we posted and we tagged Naresh and he replied and those posts have become the most successful social posts that Oracle has ever had. But I hear we have Naresh in the studio with you guys right now. Thank you, Mundy, that is right. We're lucky enough to join our U.S. cricket team captain today. Just listening to Mundy's story, what a year it's been for you. Has it been a whirlwind? I think so. I think I'm really grateful for the platform that we've got. Uh, as a national team, we've been working hard for the last two, three years and to get an opportunity to be co-hosts of the World Cup and uh, sort of clawing ourselves to be part of the top eight. I think it's a dream come true for, 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 for like every one of us in the world. Congratulations. Yes. Um, and speaking of uh, a crazy year, tell us about your experience playing for the U.S. cricket team and the T20 World Cup, Cup in particular. What was it like beating a world power like Pakistan? I think firstly, just to get to represent the country is a proud moment. And every time I wear that logo and enter the field, I just want to give my best every time for the team. Yeah. And uh, it's been a proud moment for us as each one of us is very culturally diverse in the team. We get to learn from each other. We bonded on that diversity as well, which helps us in tough moments on the field. And I think uh, our hard work has showed that we played as one unit and we got the results against the top team. So it's also been quite the year for your work here at Oracle too. You're not just a US cricket star, you are also an employee here at Oracle. So tell us a little bit about your work with Database 23 AI. I think 23 AI is really exciting. I'm getting to work on the AI vector search project, which is the next gen for our, our database our product. And uh, yeah, it's really cool to work on the cutting edge of technology, seeing that large language models have matured so much over, over the years. And it's great to be now integrated in our converged yeah. uh, our DB model. Yeah, it's awesome. I, I got to ask, though, how do you have time for both jobs? <laughs> That's my big question, too. I how think do you do it? Most importantly, it's the love for it. I'm passionate about tech, and I'm passionate about the sport. So as long as it's you passionate about it, doesn't seem like work, you love doing it, you just have to find the time to do it and to compartmentalize, you switch on and switch off, yeah. do 100% what you're do doing at that moment of time. That's good, that's good advice in life, actually. Yeah. <laughs> I'll, I'll try to remember that yeah. one. The um, last year we talked a lot about Vector Database, um, but I think it might be good like a quick refresher and then tell us what a hybrid vector index is. Okay, so that's one of the projects my team has been uh, working on. And uh, that basically combines the capabilities of the new vector search, which is a semantic search with the traditional keyword-based search. So it sort of uh, seamlessly gives the user better results where we, under the hood, leverage the functionality of both the keyword search and the vector search to give better search results. So, maybe I'm overthinking this a little bit, but is there anything that comes from playing cricket that relates to your work in developing algorithms or vice versa? I think it works both ways. Uh, from tech to, 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 to cricket, I think the game is evolving to use data, like, like analytics a lot for strategies and stuff. So. Knowing how analysis works, it helps me know where to look for, and those patterns sort of might be a, a key change maker in between a win and a loss, because yeah. the margins are really low in these tough competitive games. Sure. And same in my tech world, from sports, I learn how to handle failure, how to learn to bounce back and try, and try to work passionately towards what I want. Yeah, absolutely. Well, coming back to the vector search stuff here, um, we are leading into Juan Luiz's keynote. And really quick, why is vector search so important to our customers? I think it uh, 
transform it's a transformative capability i think just like the new electricity i'd say yeah cuz uh, all it does is it converts anything that you have text or images or videos into a mathematical vector uh -huh. in that space and then you can sort of do semantic level search where it's not the exact words that you're looking for but it understands the meaning behind it because it's trained on such large volumes of data right and what better place to find the data than the oracle database which is one of the most mature databases in the world i'd yeah. say absolutely yeah. well speaking of that uh, there are a lot of companies that make vector databases what's the advantage for oracle and using oracle's vector database like i said so you get the advantage of the performant secure oracle db with our new converged database strategy where we have everything under one umbrella of the oracle db you get your keyword search you get spatial search you get whatever you want under that hood and under all the all the in all the infrastructures you want all the data types in one place you don't have to go buy all these different databases mm -hmm. All right, well, well, we have one, one last question for you before we got to let you go. Um, I think Steve Miranda said this in one of our interviews early, earlier, which is you can't sit at the Oracle TV desk during CloudWorld and not have us ask you about AI. So um, what impact do you think AI will have on cricket and maybe even other sports? I think like I, I told you, it's already ha ha having an impact in strategizing and stuff where the game is becoming more of a mind game rather than skills i mean skills are still important right. because you need to still execute the plan that you have right but i am seeing more like inventions as in chips in the equipment where you have smart equipment to track the speed of this does the the does the, the, the swing and internet of things it will be more important i think yeah absolutely well thank you so much for taking the time to join us here at oracle tv so uh, yeah, so nice, and we, we've nice been very you. excited about this, so very excited to have you on. Thank, Thank you. you. Thanks Thank for you. having me.